Hey mommies, Ashley here from Glow Body Personal Training and today we have a sculpt and pulse shoulders for you. So we're working on defining our shoulder muscles while keeping them nice and lean and toned at the same time. So I need a light pair of dumbbells. Today I'll be working with fives. I recommend using a pair of anywhere from two pound dumbbells to five pound dumbbells for this workout. And I want you to know that we are going to decrease in time. So if this first set of three exercises feels like a long time, Bear with me, that's on purpose. I'm putting you through time under load, which is a principle just to get max results on those shoulders. And then we'll drop in time for our, our following two rounds. So let's get started, grab your light dumbbells. All right, I've got my fives right here. We're going to be doing a forward raise, lateral raise with two micro circles. And let's do it together. Your feet are nice and wide, a little bit wider than shoulder width distance apart. Forward, slide it to lateral. Two little micro circles right here and lower down. Forward, strong over to lateral. Two micro circles and back down. Now I like to think of my micro circles as little Cheerios that I'm perfectly at just sketching with my knuckles. Two perfect Cheerios. There you go. Hopefully my imagery helps you a little bit and slide it to the side. That's it, mommy. And lower it down. You're nice and controlled here. I don't want to see any rocking with the upper body. This is something I see a lot of if I go to the gym. No, we're not doing any of that. You're just using your shoulders to get this up. Great. Next exercise is a modified version of Arnold's, but we're adding pulses. So this will burn. It's not a lot of movement. That's why I just these little weights really, really are all we need. But I want arms together. Arms are parallel next to each other. One, two. Bring them to the side. One, two. Good, let's keep up this pattern together. One, two, great. Now take note of your core. I want your core nice and tight. Yes, baby belly is in the front, but you still have ab muscles, mommy. You can still tighten and use them and make sure that you are giving yourself optimal posture during this workout. What we want to avoid while we're pregnant and doing upper body work is any butt flare. So I don't want to see this happening where you're trying to push out your chest and push out your butt. Pull that under. We want a nice neutral spine. Two in the forward and two to the side. Oh yeah, I'm feeling those shoulders already. <laughs> All right, we need a rear lunge and extension pulse. So just one weight with me right now. Get ready to go into a rear lunge. Weight is at your chest. One, two, three. Step forward, other leg. Three, two, one, good. Pull it back in as you stand up. Extend. One, two, three. Step back in three, two, one. These are just micro pulses. Remember, we're only going up and down about two inches in the front. Reach back. Three, two, one. Working on the front of our shoulders right here. Really getting a lot of definition and sculpt from this move. Good. Giving you a little extra caloric burn with our step back, and then also adding a little bit of tone in those outer thighs. Back to two weights. Now that was 45 seconds of work each time. Now we're dropping down to 35 seconds. Forward raise, lateral raise, two little Cheerios. Sounds less harmless than micro circles, right? Two Cheerios. Forward, lateral, micro circles, good. There we go. Now we're working all three major muscles of our shoulders with this exercise right here. So I love it so much. Good, exhale. You're breathing like normal when you're pregnant. No fancy breathing methods while you're lifting weights or when you're walking or when you're running. Just breathe as normal, especially if you're still lifting heavy. What we wanna avoid is any um, Valsalva movement and that's when you hold your breath to lift up that really heavy weight. So just for my ladies who are still lifting heavy right now, one, two, bring it up to the side, one, two, good, back to the center, one, two, to the side, one, two. I know I'm definitely still tempted to do that. I still lift heavy about once a week. I do deadlifts and squats, as well as stiff leg, de stiff leg deadlifts, and when I do those exercises, it's really tempting to hold my breath, so I have to actively coach myself to remind myself 
Hey Ash, if you need to hold your breath, that means you need to drop down in a little bit of weight because we don't need you holding your breath while you're lifting um, just to keep baby safe and provide optimal flow of oxygen during your healthy pregnancy. All right, rear lunge and that extension pulse. So just one weight, one, two, three, bring it back in. Three, two, one. You know the pattern now, so really step it back and get your pulses. Go at your own pace, mommy. Step it out. One, two, three. Your chest is high, your torso is up, your shoulders are burning just like we want them to. And three, two, one. All right. Reach it back. One, two, three. Hello, shoulders. They hurt, but I know that I'm going to be happy that I did this when I can see my definition in my arms when we're doing all these, you know, pregnancy poses and you can still see a little bit of muscle. That's kind of a nice feeling. Forward, lateral, micro circles. Now, if this has gotten to the point where you're like, you are crazy, your weights are too much, go ahead and drop your weights and do this with just your body weight because you're still going to get a burn, you're still going to cause muscle breakdown, which is going to lead to your muscles fibers going back stronger than they were before, giving you results and new tone that you didn't have. So no shame at all if you need to drop your weights altogether. Oh, sorry, not time yet. Keep your two, keep your two dumbbells for our Arnold pulses. Arms are parallel, good. One, two. Bring those biceps across. One, two. Great. One, two. One, two. Biceps are staying parallel with the floor as they slide across to the outside. Two shoulder pulses. It's like, man, how do pulses hurt so badly? <laughs> they really do. It's a lot of time and stress we're putting on our shoulders. In a good way. Same thing. Stepping back into your rear lunge with those three pulses. This is just 25 seconds, so mommy. Two, three. Shorter than what you've done before. So I know you can do this now. All the way back in three, two, one. One, two, three. Work the front of those shoulders. One, two, three. Even strengthening our arms because, or I'm sorry, our abs because this requires stability. Awesome job. Let's stretch it out. Take your hands, link them together, and push your palms away from you. And then I want you to reach your arms up, keeping your back nice and straight. Continually pushing your palms towards that wall, towards that ceiling, and then right up next to your ears. Now it's tempting for your elbows to want to bend right here. Fight it. I want you to straighten those elbows and then reach it back a little bit further. Let's just hold this for a couple seconds. You are breathing. Maybe even feel your shoulders shaking a little bit. Totally normal. And release. Good. Same thing except for behind our backs. So we're going to interlace our hands right here. And then lift it up behind us. Once you find that sweet spot, once you go ahead and lift it another couple finger widths. Good. And a little bit higher. Awesome. Again, straighten your arms if they're starting to bend. You've gone too high. Straighten them out and lift it up. Excellent. If you're having a lot of trouble with this, then you know you want to work on your shoulder mobility. And then also go hit up my video for my top 10 prenatal stretches. We have a hip and back release, which is great for third trimester as you're training for labor. And then also um, prenatal foam rolling. Those three videos will keep your body ready to go, nice and loose for labor, which is what we want, and healthy and injury free. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and press subscribe to Glow Body PT so that you don't miss out on any of my free prenatal workouts because I am here to serve you. I love you ladies so much. I'll see you next time. Bye.